To write the name for CrCl2, we first need to recognize we have a metal and a nonmetal here. So we're going to name this as an ionic compound. Because there are two different elements, we're going to call this a binary ionic compound. So we'll write the name of the metal as it appears on the periodic table. Cr, that's chromium. And then we write the name for the nonmetal as it appears on the periodic table. Cl, we'll use a lowercase c. And then we're going to replace the ending with IDE. So we'll get rid of this and write IDE. So at this point we have chromium chloride, but chromium is a transition metal, so we can't tell its charge just by looking at it. We have to look at what it's bonded to. Right here it's bonded to two chlorine atoms. So let's go to the periodic table. We can find the charge for chlorine. That's right here, and one minus is its ionic charge. So each chlorine atom is going to have an ionic charge of one minus. Since we have two of them, this is two minus. The chromium has to be two plus. So to write the name for chromium chloride, because we have this two plus on the chromium, we're going to write Roman numeral two in parentheses. This two means that chromium has a two plus ionic charge. So the name for CrCl2 is chromium two chloride. This is Dr. B. And thanks for watching.